Hey everyone, it's Antagonist Kim, and we're back with more wildflowers. Talk to Grandma. Have you tried out the Boost Harvest Potion on some of your seeds yet? Okay. Speaking of potions... I don't know if there's... I mean, I can make flour. Yes. Yeah, Spear of Flame. Essence. How do I get this? A shimmery orange substance made in the distillery used as a... Oh, I have the distillery, so maybe... I wonder if I need bars for that. We need calcium and then the other mushrooms. Um, You know... Let's go give Natalia her coal after we tend to this. We'll pick these and sell these. Um, we will do more wheat. Oh. I gotta upgrade this. Um, let's do... Sure. I said, I don't know if this stuff's gonna last by the time I make this essence business, but... Let's see if this is the distillery they speak of. Oh, it's the juicer. So what is the distillery? Can I make that? Metal working table, fermentation barrel... Glass kiln, candle maker, paper press. So maybe I need to make so many of these to... It's like, I could do this one right now. Holy crap, it is huge. Um, I can see why they tell you you might have to upgrade some stuff. What else? Need gold. Wood. Wood. Okay. Uh, yeah. Because I think she wants ten of those, so we'll make that happen. Oh, uh, the weeds. Let's find some weeds. I need those. I need that and I need wood. Let me actually chop some stuff down real quick while I got the energy. And you know, I might have just enough of the uh, other stuff too. So I want to make an expansion on the garden. So bad. Okay. I don't know if he wants me to clear stuff out of the way though. Will it just go right here? And will it, you know, just be gone? I don't know. I don't know. Are you in here? Ah, you are. Got your quest item. Hey, this is real nice. You know, a girl's gotta learn to rely on herself. That's what swinging the hammer has taught me. Ever thought of picking one up? <laughs> me? Oh no, nope, no, no, no. Definitely not. <laughs> well, you let me know when you're ready to give it a go. I'd love to do this. That'd be so cool to learn. Um. Oh, I have enough to do one. How many do I need, though? I need ten. So far to go. I mean, honestly, let's just do all of this, right? Oops. Missed a couple there. No one's ever asked for the raw material, so... <sighs> do I really want to do this, though? Four times as much water. I'll wait on that. Let me see if I can do the expansion first and I'll cut more wood to compensate for that. Might do some more fishing, get some fish sticks going. I can sell my stuff to him though. What is up, dude? If your grandma is anything like my abuela, she won't let you forget to eat. Abuela took offense if we didn't eat at least one full plate whenever we came over. Oh, one time my sister's boyfriend said he wasn't hungry. 
Abuela talked such trash about that poor boy that she dumped him the next week. Damn. Ooh. Uh, yeah. Ooh, he'll buy these too, the silver ingot, but I kind of want to keep that though. I'm going to keep that for now. Ooh, baking something new, Angus? Yep. It's my little bro's favorite. I'm the middle child of three boys, so it was nonstop chaos growing up. <laughs> but I could always get Jamie to calm down if I gave him one of these. Uh, you don't have any siblings, do you? That must have been a bit lonely growing up, no? Oh, uh, yeah. It was lonely sometimes. But I don't really think you need a big family. Just a close bond with the ones you love. I've been trying to convince Francis of that. He wants kids, but I think we can be each other's family. Francis and I are both the middle child of three child families. Maybe that's why we're perfect for each other. We're used to being the overlooked cheese in the sandwich. <laughs> uh, I hope Francis is able to find a place for himself here and that everyone sees just how special he truly is. Aw, nice. What's up, dude? Otto tells me you're also new to Fairhaven. Did the get back to the land bug bite you too? Well, not like it bit you. I mostly came to take care of my grandmother. Hazel, right? I've heard she's a real spitfire. Okay. Marty Emerson. Ooh. Memerson. Said he's so tricky. Who wants this? Oh, okay. That is an easy one. And I have this too. I'm gonna get more of these, so why not? Get some extra cash. And you need these too? I was hoping to give Lena some tulips for our anniversary, but Violet's all sold out. I've been checking every day to see if she gets some in stock, but now I think Violet's avoiding me. Are you growing any flowers on your farm? Yes, I have yes, some. I planted a few flowers. That's great. Lena's never really understood why I love flowers so much, but she does like tulips. I think it's because they're Dutch. Oh, is Lena Dutch? Um, no, Norwegian, but that's kind of close, right? <laughs> Not even remotely. <laughs> Geography was never really my strongest subject. Anyway, if you have any tulips to spare, you would really save the day. Okay, I'll let you know if I've got some. Awesome, thanks. I absolutely do, dude. I'm gonna give you these. Wait, come back. I, I have the tulips you need, my friend. Please have them. Any luck with the tulips? Yes. Yes. Um, here they are. Thanks so much. I know it might seem old-fashioned, but I'm a fan of the surprise romantic gesture. I'm sure she'll love them, Parker. You think so? She's a hard nut to crack sometimes, but that's part of why I love her. Aw, nice. I'm glad those came in handy. I caught Finn digging through our backyard looking for worms. I thought, how entrepreneurial. He's gonna sell them to Bruno for bait, but no. He was planning to put them on Vanessa's chair. That kid. What do you need? Oh yeah. This is solid. Thanks. You're welcome. I can't believe how much you've already improved Hazel's garden. But don't run yourself down. Otherwise, you'll get a lecture from Amira. She will, like, make you better, though. I need to find Amira. That is my next, next person I must find. Uh, I think I kind of remember the trees I've got, guys. I say that, but then I forget. Lime. Oh, pineapple. One of each, right? Do I have a lime? Son of a biscuit. Hold on, hold on. Uh, wait. <laughs> oh no, where's my stuff at? Oh, here we go. Of course I don't have a lime. Obviously we gotta get that, right? Oh, spend all my money. Amira's been on me about my surfers here, but as long as I got one still doing the job, I'm all good, brah. Okay. Yes, we're taking this too. Oh, my precious money. My ranch upgrade, my everything. I got your thing, no? Please take. You brought the ingredients I asked for. They're just what I needed. I wouldn't want anyone to stay sick when I can help. Ah, uh, are you sure I need medicine now? I kind of like having a sick day. Oh, she's sick. Okay. Are you okay? Oh, Parker said that you were the one who grew such gorgeous tulips. They look so good, I was sure he'd gotten them from Violet. Okay, she got the gift. 
I'm gonna keep bugging you, Amira. So, what made you set up a practice in Fairhaven? Ugh, sleeping at the hospital, pinched nerves from standing all day, a caffeine addiction, all the delightful hallmarks of doing my residency at the busiest hospital in the city. Not that maintaining my practice here is easy, but my life feels more balanced. Nice. Good to know. Let's see if we can talk more to Cameron. What's up, dude? Do you have anything new or consciousness I center think to say? every sing? community needs a place to gather. Well, what about Damon's bar? I mean, uh, healthy place. Hmm. Okay, okay. All right, then. Hmm. Okay, anybody else we're going to talk to while we're at it? Does the bar have a name? Sure does. The bar. That isn't a name. Well, it's what everyone calls it, so it seems like a name to me. Okay, well, maybe talk to Kim. What are you up to? I tried giving Amira some lobster I caught as like a, a thank you for always fixing me up when my knife skills are not on point. But it turns out she's allergic to shellfish. Smooth, Kim. Real smooth. That is actually really good to know. Definitely don't want to give anyone something that'll make them not feel so great. Parker just sitting over there. Let's see if we can get more shells. Let's maybe catch some fish. And then as usual, we will do some mining. I have coal to make ink, so I'm not going to stress about the uh, squid anymore. Got one. Of course, haha, so funny. One thing I always stress catching, I freaking catch it. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Oh, quick! A mackerel. Holy mackerel. Let's do a chub this time. Oh! Woohoo! Okay. Nice. Pick that coconut. Catch a couple more fish along the way. Maybe I will go back to the mine today. Oh, oh yeah! Okay, a soul. I'll take it. Should talk to Thomas as well. Hey, have you met Parker yet? You mean Lena's husband? Yep. He'll help you build a tool shed when you're ready. Oh, I already have a shed. If you want to call that a shed, I won't argue with you. He can build you other things you might need, too. Hey. God, I love looking at his animal. Ooh. Oh, the kid's... <laughs> he scared me. I wasn't sure. I was like, wait a minute. I'm glad you're having a good time over there. Anything down here? Take you. Um, might do some mining. Let's go do some mining. You make some more fish sticks. I don't know if Sophia will be open tomorrow though, but that is okay. I need a thousand gold. And I also need wood for the next expansion. Right? Yeah. More wood and more money. It's always money, isn't it? Pet kitty. Hi, kitty. We have cat fur and bones. I will take them both. I don't know for what yet, but I will take it. Oh. Okay. 
it opened up five more levels. My glass is probably done, actually. Of course, I'm out of energy. Why not? I will take this coal and upgrade it tenfold. I wonder when I'll strike for gold. Yeah, that would be exciting. I need definitely need more silver for sure to do my upgrades. I only got one silver bar. I think I need like 10 or something. Like crazy. Ah, there we go. Let's keep it going. I'm glad these are just one hits. It's so nice. This one. Still got some time. Come on, baby. Gold. I need gold. though. I don't know how to tell what all I've gotten for this level and what else I need. Usually they want you to kind of get a whole collection of stuff, but... Come on, more silver, please. I could always sell the bars, although I think I do need some for building. I what time is it? It's 11.20? Darn it. It's okay. Let's go. I wonder how I get the press, though. I want to know, because I need to be able to make this copper essence. So I'm obviously missing something. Ooh. Did I not do my morning run? I thought I did. I'll take all these. Although I was curious if the stuff respawns or not. If it does, I mean, that's crazy. But... I must not have done it. Okay. Well. I did not run and look, you guys. Go to bed. Uh, we'll make the fish sticks real quick. Like I said, I don't know if she's gonna be there or not. Shrimp. Huh. Need tomatoes. Nine of these? Holy freaking cow. I mean, might as well, right? And then I'll get some more flour tomorrow. Uh, should I go to bed? Yes. Let's go to bed. It's raining, yay! I can skip watering. Oh, last day. So that means I gotta do more mining today. Have to. Must. Have you been keeping an eye on the time? 
It can get away from you, if you're not careful. So true, Grandma. So true. Let's restock the soil, though, because I do need this for the expansion. got any weeds since apparently I forgot last episode to uh look Ooh, I'll take this Ooh. this soul please this please and this oh perfect gotta do this too I need more wood I need wood for the chicken coop. Got a hundred freaking pieces. It's going to take forever. Okay. Okay. Go back in the town. Ooh. <laughs> Forget that I can vault stuff. That's so exciting. sell our stuff to you and you're not open. Well, I guess it's 9-10. When are you open? Are you closed? Yeah, closed on Sunday. Makes a lot of sense. Most businesses are. But you're never closed. You're always here, Sophia. This weather always draws a crowd to the diner. I try to make it somewhere you'd want to hole up when it's icky outside. I actually love the rain. These recipe things so bad. Yeah, let's sell all freaking 12 of these. Because then I will have monies. Yes. Cha-ching. We have money for the coop now, y'all. And I will buy all these coffees off you. Let's be real. Okay. Oh, no. I just sold her my coffee. Son of a biscuit. I need that back. That's okay. Got cash now. What's up, Cora? I'm doing it. I know y'all are gonna be like, no, Kim, you just got all this money. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, look at that pizza. Hey, Cora. We can make truffle mashed taters. And mac and cheese and duck eggs on toast. Cora is our kitty. She is on my lap. Currently. Oh, you're such a nice kitty. We're gonna talk to this child. It must be nice living with your grandma. She makes really good pie. Don't tell Sophia, but I like Hazel's better. Oh yeah, don't. <laughs> Her and uh, Sophia and uh, Grandma Hazel have kind of a little competition who makes the best food sort of Bruno thing, I guess. Bruno likes to tell stories when we're waiting for nibbles on our lines. I don't think that most of the tales he tells of fish that got away are true. But I feel like he's happy to have someone else on the docks he can tell him to. That's so cool. You know, it's been actually a really long time since I've gone fishing. Cora, do not put your face in that, ma'am. Ma'am. <laughs> Thomas makes me laugh no. sometimes. I, I think you, the grouchy exterior just hides the teddy bear heart he's got. I really do not want you to eat that. Ooh, hey. Eeh. Have I told you about the time I nearly sliced my foot off in the water? Oh, I pulled into a barrel and my board whacked me upside the head. Next thing you know, my foot's caught on coral and I'm fighting to come up for air. That sounds so scary to me. Ooh, chocolate. We already got these. I'm not gonna not gonna buy anything extra. So really, we just need to, to chop some wood, right? We got plenty of this stuff. What about this? Yeah. Holy cow. So we need lots of wood. So maybe I'll do that while I have the collecty thingy. Then tomorrow should be Monday. So in theory, Parker is hopefully open. Oh, there's another thing. Let's go in here. Ain't no mountain high enough to keep me from reaching the pinnacle. Go with logic in your minds and your eyes on the path. And that's what he said last time, right?
You visited the local <clears throat> drinking establishment, I hear? You mean the bar? I care about supporting small businesses, but I was hoping this particular small business would close when Damon's parents went back to South Africa. It seems like he really loves the bar, though. Yes, he does. For some reason. All right, Otto. I just, you are not likable at all, to be fair. Francis gets a bit restless sometimes and wants to take the ferry over to Milkwater for some culture. He says the only culture I care about is my sourdough starter. <laughs> oh my goodness. Have you been by Kai's stall? He always has interesting things to sell. Some people never leave the place where they were born, but Kai's always ready for his next adventure. Okay, Parker. Do you ever miss home, Parker? Well, Fairhaven is home now, but I miss my brother. He thought I was crazy to follow Lena out here, but he came to visit after the twins were born. And you know what? This town might be a bit sleepy, but he gets it now. Our dad worked his whole life, but in the city he could only afford our little apartment. But here, my kids can see the stars at night. That is such a good dream to have. I would love to have a bunch of land and do a bunch of cool stuff with it. Oh, Parker's always thinking up romantic things to do for Lena. Oh, I hope I find a thoughtful partner like that someday. Want some flowers, Natalia? I, I might have extra. Oh, you're sweet. But uh, flowers make me sneeze. Okay, and then Cameron. I'm so glad Sophia has her cafe just around the corner from the Consciousness Center. Counseling my members doesn't leave me much time for cooking, and my culinary attempts tend not to go too well. Okay. Okay, so we visited another Consciousness Center... Seminar? Sermon? Ooh. Take all of you. Take all of these mushrooms. Might as well do these when we come across them. Don't usually have you sitting here. What makes your medicine so effective, Amira? Hmm. You really want to know the secret? Yes! Come closer. Okay. Genuine care. Oh. I thought you might say adaptogens or whatever. <laughs> Those aren't real. Nice. Yeah, Lena's always out here too. Holy cow. Almost summer. Ah, oh, the time of year you used to visit Fairhaven. Would little Tara have ever imagined adult Tara's life here? Nope. Not even in little Tara's wildest dreams. All right. Good old Shelby. Go we'll talk to Shelby. What's up, dude? Finding your way here on the island? Yes. Well, the longer I'm here, the more it feels like coming home. Sometimes I'll turn a corner and I'll be hit by some memory from when I was a kid. Like making sandcastles at the beach with Grandpa. <sighs> Memories funny like that. You're lucky to have such ties to this place. It's special. Like I said, Shelby's growing on me. He's a cool dude. I don't think I have a pine cone yet. I don't know what I, on earth I'd use that for. Actually, I mean, I'll sell you some of these because I haven't been using them, but. Ooh. Is that. Oh, that's only 10. Yeah. Ooh, let's go shopping. This shop can now carry more stock. Cool. Okay. I guess we go clear out some more wood. I know we should go back to the mine, but kind of on this chicken coop thing. The chicken coop craze. No. 
Well, actually, now that it has got... Well, no, because I might need that for the calcium, so I'll leave that alone. Alright. Let's go take care of some of these little guys. Because I need wood. Especially while I have this uh, collector thingy. one of these. Should really make more of those. Yes. I'm curious if this is different wood, but it doesn't look like it. Okay. Oh, finally. oh man, guys. Next episode we will probably get the chicken coop. I'm so excited. Then we gotta figure out that, uh... I need the press- not the press, it was something else to get that essence thingy. Finally. I'll make more of these. I think I have the stuff for that. Heck yeah, baby. We're doing it. What else is over here? Let's clear this out just in case. I'm not entirely sure if we should or not, but... I have a feeling that I'd probably lose the utilities if I didn't. It's kind of like an Animal Crossing. Sometimes it doesn't work out quite that way, but... Ooh. If I had known... They really just disappear and I don't get all those? Is that just for effect, or am I really losing all that stuff? Oh. Whoa! What's this? A recipe? Carrot cake? Heck yeah, baby. You know, I might just do this other one, too. Why not? Will I make it through all the way? Probably not. Might as well get all the stone I can. I guess that'll be it for the episode. Okay. Just keep this going. You know, for all that stone just falling and disappearing, that's not a lot of a. Uh... Whoa! What's this? A recipe? <gasps> Lobster rolls. I will take it. Okay, anything else that I can do while we're thinking about it? I wonder if once I do the shed expansion, if it'll give me that, uh, thing I need, but maybe not. You know, after this rock, I'll just look. Um... Yeah, see, there's still stuff missing. Uh, what do I need? I need inventory. No, I, I do need the journal. I need to know how to make stuff. This. How do I do this again? A shimmering orange substance made in the distillery, used as a potion ingredient. Distillery. I don't think I have access to that yet. Um, well, this is kind of cleared out, so once I get the other expansion, you know, maybe I should do some more chopping, because I think I need more wood for that, too. I need wood for everything. Gosh darn it.
not gonna make this. I'll do this one. Alright. Let's go to bed, and then, dang, this will be the end of the episode, you guys. Next episode, we are going to get the chicken coop. And hopefully have enough to um, expand our garden area. I want to do that, too. I want to do everything. Ooh, a bunch of weeds. Okay, guys, thanks so much for joining me, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.